All right. PS2, the classic. I have never seen Seagull Joe's Ra Ra, but here we are. And Mithra is built like that. Classic wolf combo. Getting out of there with that superior air drift. All right. Up there, going to read the air dodge. Going to get another up there. Or up throw. And we're playing neutral. Put these. Oh, not quite going to kill. Fair to side B, not going to kill on that platform. It was pretty close. Oh, perfect recovery from Seagull right there. Just barely making it back. And f will definitely take that stock. Yeah, you may not be able to beat Mithra on neutral too easily, but off stage, that character is not a threat. All right, just gonna re go for the fair that time. Just tacking on shift damage, as soon as he gets them off stage, that's where the big conversions come out, all right? All right. Nair to catch the drift back in. F smash, not gonna quite take it, but that F smash definitely is gonna take it. Oh my goodness. ZD really had no other options to recover there though. So hats off to Seagull for knowing that situation. Down still putting in a tech situation, not gonna get the follow-up. Grab, up throw. Looking for an air dodge, Seagull just jumping out. Oh, great wave from Seagull, uh, not Seagull, great from ZD, Red Bell, roll in too with the up smash, just mistimed it a bit. Oh, he's running after that jab, I didn't even know you had time like that. There is safe. Oh, trade with the up B. And that's gonna take the stock. That bear is strong and safe. Does it all. Oh, is that going to be it? Not quite. Oh, 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 so disgusting. Bear into dare. What was, oh my gosh. Caught slacking. He did feel himself a little bit. He said, put that, put that rah-rah away. Put that Aegis away. When they actually pick the music, so it's good. Sticking with the arm, uh, rah All right. I don't know what stage we went to, but. Battlefield. Yeah, this is a good stage. Victor's got crazy frame traps, super good ladders. Wolf has them too, but I just don't think they're going to be the same. ZD just taking it slow. Blast turn. Down for up, yep. Oh, good drift from ZD. Good combos too. Reach for attack in place. Seagull starting off a little better than the last game though. <laughs> Playing some footsies. No edge guard attempt, just an F smash two frame. That up air just a little too fast. Didn't play connect on the platform there. Juggling. Oh, good switch into mid pit. Oh, the pyro. That up you would have been crazy if you hit it. That nair is going to take it though. Bad DR on ZD's part, I think. Not certain, but that nair is very strong. Great get off the option and disadvantage. Oh, reads the jump, but not just barely getting the space. Doesn't even matter. Picks it up. And had fair to bear, reading the drift out. Oh, the air dodge in. Seagull knew. All right, side B's back to ledge. Still in the corner though against Mithra, terrifying situation. Oh, good for the second dash attack. Not gonna quite land it. Oh, delayed up there though to start a combo. Not gonna get the grab, but still good damage. Seagull so just wants these death smashes. He's just taking it simple. He said, all right, you get hit here, you die. Yep, that you can turn that around. That move is good. And it kills. Seagull so really answering back here. Oh. Not going to get the uh, tech chase, but doesn't even matter. Picks it up again. Oh, and he needs the high recovery with an F smash. Barely missing that dare. That just would ended it all. ZD just 
ripping fares, trying to get something started. All right, back throw, yup, off stage. Fair again, oh great, now he's gotta do the side B. And then F tilt, all right, does he have his jump? He does. And semi spikes, gonna live and gets the trade. Worth it, worth it. All right, still anybody's game. One good edge guard from ZD, just like he did last game at the end of it. And that could be the game. Seagull so just gotta keep playing his game. He's doing all right. Do all right. Oh, good read on the tech roll in. Barely gonna miss that down smash. It is difficult to punish Mithra's moves. Oh, the landing hitbox. Fair to fair, looking for a bear. Seagull so just throwing out anything. He says, all right, you come here, you get hit. If not, in the corner. ZD currently looking for spot dodge after a hit shield. I want to see if Seagull adjusts. He's doing some delayed full hop aerials. They're not quite hidden. He's not getting heavy punish for him either. Oh, great spacing. All right, offstage moment. Oh, the side B catch. That was beautiful. Very nicely done. So you gotta drift here anyways, I mean, no fear. We are in a timeline, that's for sure. Stop battle. We're sticking with the Rara, -ra, of course, but uh, ZD not sticking with the Wolf. We're gonna see the Pit. Interesting. I don't know what he sees that I don't, but He's got something cooking. All right, bear to that dash tag. Full side the jab. Not gonna be able to get a true punish, but uh, just jumping over it. Now yeah, that works. Mithra's movement's so crazy fast. He really did jab and he ran up and had time to do another jab. Oh my goodness, that arrow just barely gonna miss. Maybe that's what it is. He just wants to be able to edge guard him a little easier with arrows. That makes sense. That down tilt, he did like four in a row. That thing is so fast. Oh, just barely gonna miscalculate there. Oh my god, that down tilt really clipped him. Nobody's safe in the pit. Nair, big damage, not gonna land the bear. Yeah, just hot space it, sure. No risk. Second Nair. Oh, he, he Nair the side B, is that just a stock? Oh, perfect recovery. Oh, looking for an up air to give it a cheeky kill. Ow. Lower percents, or at least set up into a juggle situation. 82, I feel like honestly Mithra, uh, Pyro's any of her moves could kill. Mithra dash attack is a jump scare. Look at it, so fast. Covers so much space, so good. All right, down throw. Push the Pyro, not gonna get the opponent parry punish, but uh, gonna pick it up with a down throw after. Ziggle needs to get the kill soon. He's looking, he's taking a little too much chip damage from this pit. But we also don't want to fish for it with Pyro, right? Much worse neutral on Pyro's end than Mithra. Ooh, ooh, that's going to be the stock. As I was saying, Pyro, much worse neutral. All right, oh my gosh, the read. All right, that move, does it poke? Is that what he just, did that just poke? Oh my goodness. Oh, good roll back from the Seagull Joe there. Oh, catch the jump with the up tilt. Yup, we up tilt him. Good ass move, good move. Up the conversion, yup. He's taking like most of this damage unanswered. All right, well, as I say that, there to get that disadvantage, up air to keep him out there. Pitt's got lots of jumps though. Tough to keep him in the air for too long. Oh, trying to read the switch. Almost got it too with that arrow. 
Gonna get the grab, back throw. Oh, the second arrow almost clipped him. The air dodge sludge gonna get the seagull out of that sticky situation. Oh, the second. Oh, the down tilt two frame. Not gonna get the bear for fair. We are playing footsies. The delay up smash. Just gonna clip ZD. Almost killed him. 135. Honestly, doesn't even need to play Pyro now. He's at 145. Mithra can do the job. Don't you don't yet. Bear. Oh, great grab. F throw not quite gonna take it yet. Oh, good switch through the arrow. Still got his jump, but. That Nair is going to take it, so uh, ZD up 2-1. The ZD pit, it was the answer. He gets a lot more opportunities to edge guard uh, Raw Raw here, and he's also just, you know, he's got the arrows to harass off stage. doesn't even need to commit, but when he does, he's making it count. And honestly, he, I mean, one of the stocks he took with the dare up smash. I mean, he's just getting out of disadvantage better with this character than Wolf. Take it with the pit. I mean, Seagull's got pockets. So we could see a switch here. Or, you know, you could just stick with the raw raw there and winners, you know. Not too serious. They play regularly, I got to imagine. Especially if they're we're going down to here in these secondaries and stuff. The Steve? Oh, no. He's hovering stuff out. Sticking with the raw raw, though. Alright, here we go. Back to PS2. Seagull saying, uh, yeah, we just, I don't, I want plats. Having plats all the time, that helps me a lot. Oh, good spot dodge, but uh, ZD gonna be ready for it. So I guess not a good spot dodge. Safe moves. Tough to deal with sometimes. Oh, that pit grab just barely gonna whiff. Catching the jump with the affair. Catching the landing with the F tilt. Oh my goodness. The awareness right there. The F tilt sent him off the, the platform and he jumped immediately. Yes, sir. Catching that jump. Just keep reading that jump. Oh, spot dodge to get through the down smash. He did doing nothing and it works out. Arrow. Looking for the bear. Oh, good roll pass by Seagull right there. Good spacing. Dash attack not going to quite take it. Putting ZD back off stage, though. Good grab by uh, Pyro there. And Bear is going to do it. All right. Damage. Ray of Punishment not going to land, but he is going to get back to the ledge. Not too heavy a punish. Up tilt to catch the jump, but Foresight. That move isn't going to be... That combo ain't true on Mithra. Oh my goodness. He just ripped the up smash. So he was trying his hardest to oppress ZD here. Just keep him in, in the air, keep him in the corner, anything he can. And ZD is really having to think to get down now. Great parries. Oh my goodness, that up there almost got it, but that down there to up smash is going to take the stock. Even stocks. One good neutral in from ZD and off stage, that could be another stock. I mean, this is still super tight. But ZD keeps having to play out of the corner here. Seagull Joe is keeping center stage very well. Nair. Nair again. Air to read the jump. Fair to cover the fall. Oh my goodness, so good. Oh, great awareness from Seagull right there. ZD dropped that jab just a little early before the rapid jab because he was on shield, and he was like, all right, I'll get grabbed. Oh, no. Good tech trace. Just jumping back to stage. Go high. Pit go low. I'm going high. Back suddenly, this game is looking super even. Down throw. Looking for an up air. Not going to get it. Mix up on the DI. Oh, the footstool, but ZD was ready with the tech. 
Okay, down tilt, down smash. Not gonna quite convert it. Beside the armor, getting him through that ray of punishment. I think that's what it is. Blazing M, just keeping him from coming in. So like, get away from me, I just want you to die. We are both sticking to our side of the stage. If you approach me, I will kill you and vice versa. Safe moves only. I don't... That killed. I didn't know Pyra had a kill throw. Even if that's at 180, still a kill throw. Oh, clipped him with the Nair. Dash tag, down tilt. Got the tech chase. Only 24 though. Jumping out of there. Doesn't want to take any damage from uh, any one hit from ZD. He's just convert into an edge guard because he's already stocked. Wants to hold on to this as long as possible. Get all this chip damage, all this extra credit. Oh my goodness. Just barely getting away from that up smash. ZD just can't find a clean opening. Seagulls are making it real hard for him to get in. Pyra F throw into Flame Nova. This on shield doesn't break alone, but it's safe as heck. And that will poke you on shield. Suddenly ZD at risk of losing his stock. Is that going to do it? Oh my goodness. Back air from below ledge. 2-2. Two -two. The Ra Ra getting it done. The adaptations on deck. We're going to Smashville. Interesting. Is he gonna stay pit? I feel like Smashville's a fine pit stage. Now back to the wolf. Hitting him with the proto ban him. I'm gonna play my main, and then I'm gonna play my other main, and then I'm gonna go back to my main. Bear dash tag, or down there dash tag, yup. Ooh, great spot dodge. Oh, if you got that two frame, that would've been it. Okay, might just still be it anyways. F tilt, down smash, yup, battle kill. Zero to death from ZD. He said, I'm not playing games no more, I'm trying to win. Seagull Joe going for a bit of an edge guard there. Getting the tech chase. ZD swinging back. Oh no, is that it? Yes sir, all right, basically two zero to deaths. He took 11% in the middle as a retaliation, but then he converted it off of it. ZD looking for some stuff, cooking it up right now. Crash tech, get him off stage. Ray of Punishment, not gonna get him. He's still off stage though. Mithra out ledge is hard to get past. Oh, the spot dodge to get through the third. Trade on the F tilt. Seagull just really mixing up the way that he's holding center stage. He He'll get caught once or twice early on, and then it's just, ooh, oh, the key frame on the side B. You are not coming back from that, sir. Bear to bear, though. Put him off stage. Delay on that F-tilt, not too big a deal. Rolling out of there. Back to off stage. ZD in the ledge trap situation. Gonna get the uh, ledge trump. That is not gonna be it. What a great recovery from Siegel. But that F-tilt will take it. Basically dead even game. The big question is, how does ZD get in, right? If Siegel can successfully wall him, this game's over. And that's what he's been doing. Laser, yep, slow pace down a little bit. The air dodge away into spot dodge. Avoid the grab. He was looking for something. Down throw into F smash. 
Fair on shield, gonna get grabbed. Landing fair into Nair, into dash tag. Not gonna commit to that edge guard. The reverse hit of down tilt, almost converting into down smash. That was almost so sick. Nair, fair, back off stage. All right, back to mid throw. Ain't nobody want to stay power for too long against ZD. Oh, more for out of there. Foresight. And effort up up air going to take it. 3-2 Seagull Joe. The so Raw Ruff sticking true to his guns. Going to work out for him. Waifu versus Squid Palmer on stream. Interesting. Didn't see that coming. Zoner battle. Oh, is that Poe? The one and only? Here to relieve me during the Zoner special? 